Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Atlas. I'm the Radio Band 03, and it is awesome to have you along. Sorry about missing the Monday episode. I fell asleep. I did. Fell asleep and slept hard. And uh, woke up, ate, watched a little something, and went right back to bed. I must have been super tired because it felt really good. But uh, yeah, I wound up missing Monday's episode because of that. So we'll try not to let that happen, but sometimes you just get tired. I am working on what we're going to put here at this here rock. I've been talking about this rock since the beginning when I saw it. And I want to go ahead and see if I can't get something kind of put together here to put up our kind of our, our display of punishment, if you will, out here. It was suggested that we put the gallows down here and stuff like that. So I'm thinking that we'll do that. Uh, that's not going to work. What's going on here? I found that it's sometimes easier to put... Uh, first person is probably better for this. Uh, let's do that one there and that one there and then come back with this and usually it'll grab uh, You can't really see much of it, but it's there. So that's a good thing. I'm gonna grab this right here And this one right here There we go. We don't need those there uh, And we're gonna have a platform up here. This will be like a blood rock or something like that blood rock uh, and this is where we uh, have our displays of execution. I will be giving the order from up there, looking down over the crowd down here, who's ever, you know, around watching. But this is what this is going to be. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put this up on legs. Uh, can I get you to go in there? Oh, right there. There you go. Perfect. Like so. Sometimes you got to put that ceiling down, and then these guys will stick to it. Because right here, it's not going to stick to anything. There's nothing for it to grab hold of. Uh, there it is, though. Oh, that's cool. Well, that is so weird. Sometimes, you know, sometimes it sticks. Sometimes it doesn't stick. I don't know what to tell you. Uh, it's not been doing this since I started working on this. Because I tried it across the front, and it just would not work. Uh, you know what I can do here, though? I can come, since I'm going to do this anyways... We are going to run these guys all the way across here. This is going to help fill in a little bit of our, our area between the elevator and the uh, uh, Harbor Master's place. Harbor Master, for some reason, is just difficult for me to remember. There we go, like that. Okay, so that's as high as it's going to go, and a part of that rock is going to be showing through the top. And that's okay, that's, that's why we call it Blood Rock. We're going to do that, and we're, we're kind of encasing this rock. I'm not going to hide the rock completely. Well, I'll show you what I'm going to do. We're going to build it right now, so let's just do it. Uh, Jeffrey and um, uh, Velma are down here right now. Ooh, I'm warm. Look at that. So it must be a warmer day today. We're at noon. I'm wearing the hide armor. This is the first time I'm getting this icon while working out here. Hmm. What if I do that? That didn't make it go away. Hmm. I'm going to stay in it. I'm not losing. I'm not taking any damage or anything like that. So no big deal. It's just always interesting when that kind of happens to see, you know, what's going on with you at the time. If it does get worse, it's not going to hurt me right now, but uh, we'll see. Oh, there, it's gone now. So maybe it's be because I moved over here. I don't know. I don't know. So we're going to go up one more because we have to. Otherwise, it's just not going to look right. And I've got an idea for what we're going to do uh, on each of these corners, too. You're hot. Yeah, it, I come down here and I get a little bit warmer. Look at that. That's pretty cool. Kind of a hot spot in the world. Oh, you kidding me? I'm short by one. We may even need a few more of these guys just to kind of finish this out on top. We'll see. We'll see what we're going to do. It's not going to be enclosed on top, though. I made the um, the guillotine, but I've not been able to find a gallow. And I thought there was one. I know there's like a, a noose or a hangman's noose. There's, there's something in here. I know it is somewhere. I've seen it. I'm thinking it might be up at the, um, possibly the, the loom may have it or it's the uh, the tannery but I can't look it up it's not in the work it's not in the workbench here come on now yeah it's not in the workbench down here it's not in my inventory so I'm not quite sure where it is let's grab uh, a bunch more of those uh, we've got 11 more that's it huh it's always amazing how fast you go through stuff I'm just going to I don't know why I'm trying to drop it that way drop it like that 
I just want to get an edge around here so we've got something to get up on. There we go. Make it to the green arrow is pointing out. Ooh, I missed one of my poles right there. Like so. You guys are doing great. I'm doing really well. It's it's a Wednesday. It's a Wednesday. Let's jump up here. Yeah, see, this is going to look good. Let's take this last three and kind of seal this off right here. Yes, and then we're going to do this all the way up around until it meets up with the top of this rock right here. And then we're going to build our kind of our kill area and some seating and stuff like that up here um, when uh, we get this all enclosed up. That'll be great. I've got what we need. You know what I want to do? Let's run up to the house real fast. The lair. And check the, the loom and the tannery. See if there is a rope in there. I think there is a rope, but I'm not, I think it's for the ship for some reason. I don't know why I do, but I, I feel like it's something you could put on the ship. We'll take a look. If we can find one and make one, we will. See how it works, and then we'll incorporate it into that platform. Right now, what I have, I'll go in my inventory here real quick. I have the guillotine. Mm-hmm. Made it at the smithy. Real easy to make. It's actually under furniture, which is extremely weird, but that's what it is. And it works. It does indeed work. Pretty amazing. Uh, we're almost to the top of our ride. Very good. Very good. Thank you for the continued support on the series. Last episode, we hit 50 episodes. You guys were excited about it. I was excited about it. It's very, very cool. Uh, okay, so we're going to check the loom and the tannery. Uh, let's go structures, furniture. There's wood. There's a drum set. We don't have one of those. We should probably make one of those. Uh, weapons, primitive, ranged. That's the bolas. Armor, attachments. Fur, okay, that's hide, no. Yeah, well. Okay, so it's not in here. If I go H-A-N-G, no. How about noose, no. Okay. I thought I saw one. I'm, I'm pretty sure I did. Oh, here it is, right here. The hanging noose. It's a structure. Well, let's do it. I'm going to make another one, just because two is always better than one. And let's see what this guy looks like. Uh, they stack. Okay, so number six. Oh, no kidding. Okay, all right, we can work with that. It'll attach to something like that right there. So, yeah, we can definitely work with that. Whew, toasty. Toasty warm. We're okay. We're going to be just fine. Uh, our food is getting down a little bit. That's good. I'm not very hungry, though. That's, that's, that is a problem. So we're going to have to fix that. Yeah, that'll work out. Uh, that'll be a nice platform right there. I don't think it's higher. Than, well, it's about the same height as this right here. How you doing? Uh, he's got, got piles, got some levels on him. Let's go health. I've been splitting them between health and stamina. Okay, so we've got those going for us next. We've got that. Fantastic. Let's get some more of those ceilings. Uh, we are out of ceilings. I did go out and get the wood, the thatch, and we already had the fiber in here. We've got a little bit of stone and metal, too. I may have to bring uh, charge down. I may. Uh, let's do another <sighs> missing thatch. And 17. Yeah, let's do 17. That sounds pretty good to me. We'll see how far that gets us. Should take about a second to make these. Yeah, what have you mentioned, I don't know, 10, 15 episodes ago? You, you need a place to, uh, you know, you need a gallows. And I thought, gosh, you know, I was talking about putting the inn and the tavern here. And I thought from up there, you could see down here, be a perfect place to stand and just, you know, run your finger across your throat and bam, they're gone. <laughs> Give the order. Give the order. We're pirates after all, right? There's there's bound to be some harsh punishment going on for sure when you screw things up. And yeah, I, I like the fact that the rock is going to be sticking through up here. That was intentional. I love it. It gives the thing a little bit of a, a story. 
Uh, so much blood's been spilled on that rock. So much. Okay, so if we do this here, we've got this taken care of now. There's our base. All right, so let's go back to number, let's go to number eight. Uh, that is the wrong side. Number eight. Red arrow out, as you have told me. I want to bring these guys all the way up to the top, like so, right there. On the corners only. There we go. And this works out perfect back here. We have to put this one on first, and then that one. And this guy here is going to be fitting right about here. Uh, get one more in there. All right, beautiful. Now, is that enough to give that a good look? I could come down this side too, in front of this here, to give it a little more strength, maybe double it up. Do I have two in the front and two on the other? I've got two on the other side. Over here, we've got a space, so we've got one extra over here. Hmm. <laughs> so what I could do to remedy that is bring this all back by one more, and that would work pretty well. Uh, yes, get rid of it. There we go. That's okay, no big deal. It's just a little bit of wood thatch and fiber. Easy to get. If I do that right there, and I come back one more... Then that, that, that puts me right here, right? I can do one here, one here. I got a space, and then, yeah, one more. Okay, so that's going to work out even better for me right there. So let's do that instead. And then we'll be even all the way around. And I need... Ooh, let's see, demolish. Let's get all these materials back. We'll take these back with us, and we'll put them to use. Uh, we got a problem there, Houston. I can't see that one. Come on. Hmm. Did I put another one down here? I thought I did. Uh, we'll find out soon enough. And then I'll have to figure out how to get it out of there. Uh, you guys have told me about a ghost way of doing it, but oh my gosh, that was so long ago and I've never tried it, so... I don't know. Um... That, let's make is let's craft up a bunch of those again. Let's grab a little bit of this and a little bit of that. And some of that as well. And let's do another, yeah, let's do eight of those. We might as well. We're going to need them anyways. Walls, I have four on me. I'm going to need some more of those as well. Let's see if we've got any more of those in here. We do. Five, ten, fifteen. Let's get twenty-four. That sounds good to me. All right, let's go back here. Did I grab poles? I did. I've got seven. Okay, beautiful. Oh, I don't need more than seven, though. I'm going to need quite a few. Yeah, I'm going to be coming all the way down an extra row here, and this that back row needs to come out. Yeah, these guys need to come out. Oh, that one doesn't. <laughs> that one doesn't. That's on the end. We didn't need to do that at all. Yeah, okay, let me get this switched around. I'm almost there. And then I'll bring you back and we'll work on, uh, you know, whatever we're going to do next on here. We need stairs that go up to it as well. Ran out of the wood. Had to go get, take Velma up into the forest real quick. Almost there. Just ran out. I didn't have enough to make the post. And I'm going to need more anyways because we've got all kinds of extra... Things we've got to make just to fill in this area and make it look a little bit, uh, you know, a little bit snazzy, a little bit more lived in, right? It's going to be a little more lived in. Some of these things require just your imagination. It's just nice to have these interesting things filling up space, I think, sometimes. Do that right there. I also want to get started here really soon on our battle brigantine. 
we may even look at where we're going to put that today just so we can get started on a brigantine that we're going to use specifically to just take out and give it a shot and see if we could take out the pirate ship that's next to the island here that's going to be the first target that i'm going to go after is that so i think that would be kind of fun to to try out and i've been kind of pushing it off a little bit but uh it's time we'll, we'll, we'll do it now we've got to do it let's make 13 of those and then i'll make whatever else uh yoohoo hello i'm standing here did you see that velma <laughs> she kind of just pushed me out of the way there she's just like move it's not the first time that's happened I don't know what I did, but she seems a bit disgruntled lately. Hmm. Maybe I took her out of her natural habitat? Then that could be it, right? Okay, so I'm going to do that right there and that. There we go. And again, just watching to see if the red arrow is um, pointing outwards. And it is, I think... I'm thinking about coming down this way too, right? That's what I said. That's what I was going to do. I was going to do that one there. That's why we moved that whole wall. Something right there. I just want it to look like it's got a little something more holding it up than just what, you know, just a bunch of the, the, the wood poles look skinny to me. They just look really skinny to me and I need a little something to, we need some, a beefier option and there's probably a mod out there, but I'm kind of hoping we'll just get it in the regular game. Something like that right there, but I'm not sure if I, oh, you know what I could do now? Hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. I was going to square these off, but then I thought, nah, it's just going to look, it's going to look too square. So let's go like that. And like that. Yeah, there we go. That's going to work out just great. Oh, uh, no, this one. Is it that way? It is that way. Okay. I think that's a nicer way to to fill that in. Get your water. It's free. Grab it now while you can. Uh, yeah, that looks... That's better. Hmm. No, it's not better. No, it's not better. Um... Yeah, no, I, I can I can do better than this. I can do better than this. I'm just thinking to myself, you know what? You've got all this extra... You've got this room. You should really try to make use of it. I need to get to that. So let's... I'm going to have to use this. This is going to be kind of a pain in the butt to take off, but i got a different design idea for this that's going to kind of... It'll fill it in a little bit more, but I think it's going to... It's going to tie it in with what's going on upstairs as well. So let me go ahead, and I'm going to take these down, these these little corner pieces I just put in. I went too fast to... I went over too far here. Uh, wood slope wall right. Demolish. There we go. And number six. There we are. Number six. I should be able to grab the one on the back wall pretty easy. We're just going to give it a little swing here. There we go. And number six. There we are. And I should be able to reach this one just fine. Yeah. Okay, so instead of that, let's grab a bunch more of those walls. I got a different idea. And it, it, we're, we've got kind of a theme going on here, and I need to remember that. We don't have it, have to all have it, have it all look the same, but it's nice to, you know, kind of stick with that theme. Uh, let's grab this back, this and this, and then I want two more of these, and we're going to need a whole bunch more of these. 26 of them? That sounds pretty good to me. Let's get those going. Uh, in the meantime, let's throw these poles. Uh, oh, I needed one more pole. Uh, okay, so what we do is we'll drop the poles in, and we'll just double-click on it, and we'll get one back. We need one for the the spot I missed up front here. Uh, for some reason, it's 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 lurking in a shadow, and I'm not seeing it. This guy right here. Boop. There we go. Beautiful. Okay, so now what I want to do is I'm going to come back with. Hmm. Yes. I'm hit E each time. And then this right here. This right here. 
Oh, sorry. It's the wrong side. So now we know it's the other way. It's the last one. Rotate Q. What's going on here? Come on now. Hmm. This is not as... Oh, there it goes. Okay, there it goes. There we go. Okay. And then what I think I want to do... <clears throat> Excuse me, I don't I don't like the fact that the rails don't have anything underneath them. I don't like that. So what I think I'm gonna do here is go back to the half wall and double up what I've got going on up there, like that, and we'll just keep the kind of the vent on the side, like so. Let me get my lantern out. You guys can see a little bit better. I'll take a break too since it is dark and we'll uh We'll resume when the sun comes up. Something like that, though, I think works better. And then if I wanted to... Now, so I could take this and move it up one and then have one down here at the bottom, too. And that way, it would kind of look like the windows we have up on the side of the lair itself up there. But I think this is going to work out just fine. God, the other part of me thinks I could do something like that down here, too. But I'm going to leave this open underneath here. This is going to stay open. I'm going to do that on each of these sides. And then I'll come back. And the sun should be up. Well, this thing's going to have to be a little bit different, isn't it? Oh, I forgot to go down the sides with these guys. Maybe I should have this look different from the other sides. Because I've got all the extra supports on the other side. This is the wrong one. That's the problem with it being when it starts getting dark. Let's see. I've been at this forever. I had to take that rail out in order for it to go in to where it needed to be properly. Very strange. But I think the reason this is this is sitting, I think, backwards, this rail, and that's why this is seeing it as being wrong. The yellow side of this is not out. It's the actually the trimmed up nice side. So anyways, it's, it's in there now. It's good to go. <clears throat> Maybe I should do something down here at the bottom. How about a half wall or something? Just to kind of, you know, kind of shore this up a little bit so you don't have things walking in underneath there like that. Something like that right there. And we could bring this over. I've not decided what to do with this side yet. We'll just do something like that right there. And then I think what we're doing up here is we're actually doing two of these, right? There we go. Two of those. And, yeah, we'll just keep these sides kind of simple because they've got everything they need on them right now. Like that. They've got little extra supports that the other side doesn't have, but this will kind of trim that out a little bit and make it look kind of nice. I guess that's what I'm thinking. You just have to hit E on the first one, and then the other one will go just where it's supposed to go. Oop, there we go. I like the vegetables growing up in here. That's nice. It's kind of cool. The water can get through if it needs to. When it rains and stuff. Uh, we're out of those. Let's go get... Do I have any more in my inventory? I do not. Let's go grab some more. Do, 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 do. Yeah, we got to get to the battle brigantine. We, we need to do that. Uh, walls. I can make one. I like to use up that old stuff first if I can. Sometimes it's not very easy. It doesn't like to cooperate with you. And I'm going to make 12 more. I'm probably gonna need a lot more than that actually let's go ahead and do that and that and that again and then let's go ahead and make another 13 of those i'm thinking we're going to use these up above along with the poles to uh kind of create a little bit of a fence around that area up there am i encumbered no okay let's grab we got nine of these can i handle that i can all right let's take a look and see what we could do up here with um Let's get the side finished up first. Let's take just a second. The sun should be coming up here shortly. I just wanted to show you what I needed to do to resolve that issue. Sometimes you got to take things out before you can put something in. Like so. 
And like so. There we go. Okay, so we've got that taken care of there. Now for rails, I want to do something different with the rails. This is kind of... Yeah. I wish that this pole right here would connect on each of the corners, each of the four corners, and each in between each of the four corners. So we would have what would be 3, 6, 9, 12, 13 snap points in here. Three on each side, and then the middle. It would really be nice, because I would love to have this guy right on the corner here. Right on the corner. Right here would be fantastic, but that's not going to be the case. Um, so we have the noose. How are we going to hook the noose up to where we could hang somebody? Oh, I got an idea. I have a bit of an idea, but before we do that, let's go ahead and take the guillotine. Let's get it set up. This guy is kind of, uh, just kind of simple. I see that. I feel like most people will be watching, like you would bring your ship up and park near shore, but not on shore, but that's where you'd be when you'd watch some of this. There'd be people here too, but this is where the watching would be done. I'm going to think that this guy can go right about here. Yeah, and he totally works. <laughs> I don't know if we could... I wonder if I could load a uh, NPC in here and actually do this. I'll, we will try it sometime if I get extra crew members. I would love to try that out and see if that actually works. Can you take a crew member and have them get into that? We can actually try that just by itself. Okay, so that's the guillotine. Uh... I'm going to pick it up. Where do I want the hangman's noose? They're going to have to fall all the way. They've got to fall through and down a little bit. Uh, that's for sure. I have two ropes. What if we do... Something like this. Um, I'm just thinking, where am I going to attach the rope to? What I'm thinking is I'm going to do is I'm going to put ceilings off the top of this right here kind of seal in the edge and then put one of the ropes right here and one of the ropes right here and then we could take this out take this one out of here this one out of here that's enough space to drop and dangle I would think <laughs> sounds horrible but that's what this is so let's go with this here real quick Go six. What we're going to do is we're going to turn these into the hatches, like so. And then we can put our ropes up here. Uh, yeah, let's go ahead and do. Yeah, if they walk up and put the rope around their neck, we drop that off, and they drop a foot or two. That's that's bound to be plenty, right? That would be plenty. You know, you don't want to you don't want it to be torture. Uh, Q. Those aren't going the right way. I wonder if I come over here, if I place one over on this side first. Q? No. Hmm. I don't think anyone's going to really see those, so we're going to do that right there. We're going to go ahead and do that. Number eight. Like so. Oops. There we go. The ropes. Get a rope. Oh, they're there. What the heck did I did I turn them into something else? How weird. Okay, so we're gonna do this right here, and we are gonna put one. 
right there. And then one right in the middle here too. Hmm. Okay. Oh. Why is this one so much longer? Why is that so long? Oh. Well, <laughs> okay. That doesn't make any sense to me. They are so long. Uh, so I actually need to have this go up even higher. Like one more in order for that to even work right. I mean, this one's not too bad. But it would be better if it hung up higher for sure. So let's go ahead and demolish that. And we're going to have to take this up at least one more, I think. Maybe what I should do is box this in a little bit. Or, or what I could do here is actually to make this look like it's more permanent is to do something like... Like that. No, it's not right. Okay, I'll have to get this one put into here. Ay, 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 ay. So let's go like this. There we go. Okay, that worked out just fine that way. And then what I could do here is I could put ceilings or roofs across the back of this just to make it look like it's fused to the dock, this, this decking more. But yeah, I think we're going to have to go up one more on this just to get it to kind of look uh, right. Can I reach these? I can. Fantastic. All right. So yeah, let me do this next. I'm going to take this off, raise it up a little bit, and then we'll get... Uh, well, I need to make another rope for sure. I'm not quite sure how they decide how long the rope should be but uh what, what they did there was too short i wonder if just a half wall can i go on top of a half wall with the ceiling i have one of these left okay number six i can okay so maybe that's enough let's go to the let's get the rope back and see because it didn't have to go up too high. I didn't want it to go, you know, super high. <sighs> it didn't do anything. It's exactly the same. It's doing exactly the same thing. And it's exactly where it was last time. I wish there was another way to get that to go up, even, you know, keep going up. Can I make another ceiling? Yeah. I can craft three, huh? Let's craft two of those. We need at least two. I'll put it up and then see what you guys have to say. You guys let me know what I'm doing wrong or if it's just, you know, there's nothing I can do about it. Okay, inventory. We need our ceilings. And then I need to make another one of those ropes. Throw the guillotine in there. Okay, so I need another rope. Uh, and I've... I need to... Oh, I don't know if I can do the angle thing now on the sides of that because I put the half wall in there and not a full wall. I think I got an idea for that too. How many walls do I have left? I have seven. Okay, so let's make one of those. Let's grab some of this, and some of this, and some of that. And we'll make 13 more. And then we'll run up and get another rope and stick it on there and see how it looks. And we'll get the guillotine placed as well. There we go. We're going to take you guys right there. And we'll put you down here too. And I think I'm done... Oh, look at you, Belma. You got yourself a level, huh? Very good. 
Uh, we're going to give her stamina. Oh. <laughs> it's fun to shake when she falls. She drops like that. Uh, I got six more. Can I carry them? I can. All right, beautiful. Let's take these guys up there. It sits kind of towards the front of this, but I'm okay with that. This back area can be for... Uh, we'll put some benches and things like that. That's where you kind of get them set up. And you bring them up to the front here. And the justice is served, you know. Or what was justice, anyways. Six. Half wall. You're nothing but a half wall. <laughs> okay, let's do this one here. Your mother was a half wall. No. See, now it shows me the red arrow. But it's because of that guy above that I'm getting this this hassle, I think. Yeah, that's exactly what it is. This guy right here. Oh my god. I missed it by a second. Now, I'm willing to bet. Oh, well, let's see. Is this going to work? It's so tricky. Oh, I can do it up here. Really? No kidding. I did not think I would be able to do that. Oh, that's good to know. Okay, that, that works out even better then. Sometimes the mistakes you make are the best mistakes ever, right? And I think we have to go past the first one, right? And then we've got that one there. Oh, all right, perfect. All right, that worked out just great. And then, yeah, we'll put the other rope here, but I'm, I'm a little surprised that this one isn't hanging a little more, like, you know, neck level. I don't know. I, I guess it's something you could adjust as you were doing things, right? You had somebody that you were going to be dealing with. Uh, and then this guy right here, we're going to kind of caddy corner him a little bit, like so. God, I don't know which of these I'd rather have done to me if I was going to be put out of my misery. What would you pick? Hangman's noose or the guillotine? Which would it be? Like so. And then we've got everything up on display here, too. All right. Oh, I know what we could put back here. I know what we could put back here. Okay. Um, yeah, I do. I know exactly what we could put. And then, yeah, you're standing out here and you're watching this, right? And then, you know, boom, down it goes. Sweet mama. All right, now we're going to do, uh, we're gonna do, grab some of this, and some of this again, and some of this, and we need uh, two doors. I think I've got two in that chest over there, but I don't care. I'm going to make two more. I needed three of these, right? For the back of that wall. And let's do... A few chairs. We are gonna need. Oh, we're we're gonna need uh, ramps up to the ladders up to that, or stairs, I should say, up to that. I'm gonna make another four of those. And do we have ceilings on us? We don't. Let's grab a few more of these. We got a couple we can make. Okay, and then I wanted to also do. Yes, let's make. I can make nine of those. Let's make three. And then there was a, the, the gibbet, right? The gibbet. Let's make two of those. Let's throw that back in. What do I, I've only got two ceilings. That's not going to be enough. It's, it's, there's no way that's going to be enough. I'm going to be encumbered. Maybe not once it's been done crafting. Okay, we're going to grab these guys back first, and then we've got two gibbets. All right, beautiful. Now, the stairs for this, I think what I'm going to do is put the stairs actually on the opposite side over on that side there. Okay, so let's get this taken care of first. We'll get a little bit of weight off of us. Uh, let me turn off my light because it's very bright. Eight. Let's go to the ramp. And let's go like so, like so, and like so. Perfect, just like that. That gives it a little bit more, a little bit more body to it, right? A little more, a little more body to it. 
Uh, we need the other rope, of course, and then I've got some doors. We've got two doors, and I want these guys to sit, of course, down here because these would be what we would drop out from underneath their feet, right? Hmm. Can I swap these around to be differently? Different. Raise the rope. Okay, Q. Hmm. All right, well, it's going to have to be this way. It represents it, right? I thought when you stood on top like this and you pushed. There it goes. There it goes. Okay, so that does work that way. It does go down. As long as it does that, I'm, I'm happy. There it goes. Okay, perfect. Perfect. All right, so we've got our, our, our hangman's area. We've got the guillotine. Um, it's got its own bucket on it, which is fantastic. I think, let's see, do we have enough of these? We've got 23 of these. Six. I'm going to want to jump all the way down to these guys right here. Shoot. Going too fast. Like so. Well, now you guys are going the wrong way. I'm doing the wrong thing anyways. Ay, 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 ay. That's because this is what ran through my head first, but then I thought, why would you do that? Then you can't see through the rails and see what's going on up here. And that's the whole idea. Even this one is wrong. All right, let's see if we can get this worked out right. Let's try this again, a little bit slower, and get it done right. Oh, you don't have to... I, I keep thinking I have to flip it. I, I did for this first one, but it doesn't seem to me need to be done for this other one. Oh. Well, okay then. That does have to be flipped out. Oh, this one's wrong. There we go. All right, let's get this down here. It's easier this way because then I can see which way that lip is going. So let's do this. That one's already facing the right way. That one needs to be turned. That one does not. That one does. Does. And we're going to seal this off up here. I would love to have a crew member kind of standing up in this area. We'll get one that's got a different outfit and stuff that looks a little bit different that we set up here. Be kind of cool. Okay. It's kind of weird how every other one has got a little something different. I wonder if that's got to do with which way the floor piece is sitting. Okay, so we've got that blocked off there. we got this over here. Let's go to our inventory. We've got a few more things we can place. I'm pretty sure I've got to have one of these in each of these in order for it to work. They don't stack, so... Alright, so what we're going to do is we're going to put one of the prisoner's cages right here. Hmm. Something happened there. Did not let me place it. Come on. Hmm. That was weird. It was not letting me place that. Yeah, we're going to put this one kind of a little bit crooked. Like so. There we go. And then we need one more. I think I'm going to put one more right next to this one here. Almost like jail cells. There we go. And then let's add our chairs. One kind of right here. Uh, where are our stairs going to come up at? That, that's probably something I should work out too. Where the stairs are going to go. Let's go to inventory. Let's grab these guys right here. And let's just figure out. It doesn't have to be a fancy staircase. It's just going to go straight on up. 
There we go, like so. Um, is there any way I can get you to turn and go that away? I bet if I put a foundation back here, you'd do it. Hmm. I think I'd rather have it start back here, to be quite frank with you. Frank. If I do that there, inventory, I should be able to pop this out. Let's put the, one of these in here, and we'll move one of these here. And now I should be able to do the stairs down from here. If I get this to sit just right, there we go. There we go. Yeah, into the dirt works out perfect. Okay, that's great. The other option is, hold on a second. Instead of that, let's go like this instead. And then... The long walk of shame, man. The long walk of shame. Up, up, up. In your jail cell you go. Ready for execution. On the longest guillotine rope in the world. <laughs> Not guillotine, but gallow rope. <laughs> Alright, and then we go here. Uh, I'm going to need, what, one, two, three, four, five. Uh, five more rails. So let's get five more railings. I'm hot again. Interesting. Do I have any more walls? No. T. T. It's amazing how much resource you go through when you are doing this. Oh, I do have walls in my ceilings in my inventory. That's what I was looking for. No, 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 no. Stop, stop, stop. Never mind. That's not what I was supposed to make. It's okay. We'll use them. We'll use them. I need one more. Uh, I'm guessing that the wood is probably what I'm shy on. No, the thatch is what I'm going to be shy on. Thatch. There we go. I'll get rid of that right there. All right, beautiful. All right, now let's go get this finished up. Maybe. We'll see. I'm going to have to make some more stuff. We need more of these just for down here alone. So let's go back to here. That one was sitting the right way that time. You're sitting the right way. Oh, that's all. Oh, I see where that's sitting. Oops. Nope, no, 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 no. Let's get rid of that. Do I have... Can I make another one? I cannot. Okay, so yeah, this is sitting on that extra piece of wood right here that juts out from the side that's supposed to support the corner. Uh, yeah, that's what it's doing all right. That's what it's doing. Okay, so this one all looks like it might be wrong right here. This, this particular corner. Uh, maybe not. Maybe not. All right, let's at least get one more of those, though, so we can finish that up. It, it's obviously wrong because it's sticking out farther than the other ones. Never mind. And nine more of those. Wow. I've gone through two full trips for wood. And one thatch so far today. We've had one thatch run today. It's still holding up the thatch. The fiber's fine because it lasts forever. But yeah, we definitely uh, burned through the wood today. Which is fine, of course. This is wrong right there. Uh, seven. I'll have to fix that up on my own. You can see it's just jumping around like crazy. If I go Q and then E. There we go. Okay, that should be better. That's better right there. Uh, we got some stairs here. We've got a few more of these guys. We're going to go like that. There. Like that. Like that. Bam. All right. Beautiful. Look at that. Takes us right down to the bottom. That's fantastic. I love that. 
Now, if I go number seven, I should be able to seal this up, and that's going to be the wrong way. Number seven, uh, E. Okay. We're just going to box this off like we did the other side, and it should look really good. Uh, did I not make enough of those? Wow, it's amazing! <laughs> All right, let's do it again. Let's get some more. We're almost there. We've almost got it. It'll be completed. An entire project done pretty much in a day. Maybe a little decorative stuff if you guys got other ideas. Of course, as always, let me know. Always welcome. Which you know. Uh, I've got 12 more, huh? Okay, so let's just... Uh, well, let's drop this. There we go. Let's drop that. I've got these gibbets to place as well. The lanterns are still burning. They probably will be burning much longer, though. Number seven... So I hadn't realized this, but my vitamin deficiency is actually killing me right now. My health is going down. I'm just probably a little bit below half. I think it's kind of interesting. I didn't know it would do that. But yeah, vitamin deficiency, if it's left unattended, it goes quickly. I don't have food uh, cooked up and prepared, so I'm going to just do what I need to do to, uh, you know, live. <laughs> okay, let's do that. Let's do that. One of those. All right, all of those. Let's see, do I have any berries left in here? I don't. I, th these are pretty much emptied out because I put everything in the upper area. Uh, I do have some berries here, though. Let's do those right there. Uh, inventory. Uh, we could eat a little bit more. Let's eat one of these. There we go. And we could drink another one of those. And let's do another one of those. And I'm going to actually eat two of these. I may overeat, but that's going to be okay. Looks like I'm going to have to do probably a little bit of yelling before I eat again next time. Just to kind of get the food levels up. Because I could go much higher than this right now. And have the vitamin buff for a much longer time. I used to think that you had to kind of hover in between that entire line. But it's not the case. You could fill it up as much as you want. And the more full it is, of course, the longer the vitamin buff will last. So there's, there's that. And I didn't realize that at the beginning. But I do now. Uh, what am I I'm missing? Fiber? Oh, really? Shocked, I say. Shocked. Uh, let's grab a couple of these. There we go. Bingo. Bongo. Boingo. And it looks like I might have some lanterns out up here. Uh, yes, we do. We need to get some oil and get these lanterns taken care of again because we can't have us being in the dark when we're up here at the uh, lair. So, uh, it's real easy to do in case you don't know. Once they're empty, it says refill common lantern. You just hit E. It's so much nicer to be able to do this than to have to do um, access inventory and all that stuff. So it's better. I just can try to keep an eye on them. I've got one over here too. I thought I noticed this one out earlier today. Like so. And then I believe, yeah, we've got one right over here. Uh, this one's a little bit tricky to get to because there's stuff close by it. But otherwise it works just great. And then these guys should be dead as well. These were working when I first got on today, so they've just run out of oil since then. There we go, like so. Doesn't take but a second to come around and fill them all up. And we've got one right over here, too. There we are, like so. And I think that's got all of them. And then I always make sure I take and do this one as well. Because I tell you, man, you know as well as I do if you play the game, the lantern is a huge help. Just a huge help. It really is. Uh, especially for recording. I mean, this is just a, a big time help. I should probably have a... Well, you know what I usually do is I usually have these guys going, but they have all... They've turned everything into charcoal, so the campfires are not going right now. Which we could remedy that too. Let's do that. I'm, I feel like today's episode is going to be kind of short. And then again, it never is. I'm always surprised. I say that, and then I go and take a look at how long it is, and it's like, oh, no, this isn't short at all. <laughs> This is, uh, this is a regular episode for your radio. <laughs> it's what I do. It's what I do. And you go right here. There we go. Beautiful. Look at that. That's going to look nice from down below. Yeah. Whole place is all lit up again. That's fantastic. Dun, 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 dun. Yep. Mm-hmm. Emerald Point Lair. It has come together quite nicely. I'm, I'm pretty pleased with it. What would you guys like to see next built here? 
we'll do the brigantine thing. We're going to do that. We're going to have to make cannons and all that stuff and get that kind of ready to go. Matter of fact, we need to go on another run and grab a few more crew members. Um, because the ones we have, there's a couple I don't want to take with us because I don't want to lose them. Uh, like our first mate there. Uh, we're angry. She's always mad. And the first few I'd like to actually keep and not actually possibly lose. Uh, we're back down here. Okay, so... The rope. I need the other rope. Number six. That's at number nine. So we can see what we're doing. Yeah, this turned out just great. I'm happy with this. Except for the ropes. They're kind of weird. It's kind of weird. That one looks better this time. A little bit better. And it's kind of funny because this one is hanging lower now than that one was. And that one used to, was going all the way down. Raised rope. And I can even raise that one. Look at that. That's that's like perfect. Almost. Almost perfect. Well, different different levels, I guess. It said raised rope, right? <gasps> oh. oh my god. They both snapped into place perfectly. That's what I wanted. Now, we could do a third one here, but I, I think I'd rather have these guys spaced apart a little bit, just in case one of them starts to go nuts, you know, because he knows the end of days are here. Yeah. Oof, sweet mama. Oof, ouch. All right, that's going to wrap up today's episode. There it is. Look at this. Yep. Blood rock. Blood rock. Hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button for me. Comment, subscribe, and share. I'm the Radio Mancer 3. <laughs> Have an awesome, fantastic, and a superb day. And I do look forward to talking to you again next time. I never do that right.